welcome to yet another episode of Poor Man Road to Glory. I freaking hope you guys are enjoying two episodes minimum a week of the Poor Man Road to Glory. It's taken me forever to upload these damn long ass videos and edit them, but I can see you guys are enjoying them, so long may they continue. Now, to a lot of new people to my YouTube channel and maybe even my Twitch streams and stuff, you will remember this. Holy God have mercy! Thank you for the subscription as well! Um, you won't remember this background in any way. This is a background that I had someone make for me like two years ago for my streams. But I don't have yet, even though we've been doing the Poor Man Road to Glory for like five, six years, we do not have like a Poor Man Road to Glory background, and we do not have a Poor Man Road to Glory like themed uh, main gameplay background. So I'm gonna get my guy Tice to make us a themed intro screen for the Poor Man Road to Glory, like a commercial screen and a themed gameplay background so that, you know, this series just goes up another level in terms of uh, what's there for you guys and stuff like that. So that's the first thing we're going to do if you're, uh, I wanted to explain if you guys were confused about this relatively weak background. This is like from my early days of streaming in YouTube, but I think we're going to get right into the episode. There's so much to cover. Obviously the title and the thumbnail, as incredible as they are, have given away a lot of what's going to be happening in the episode. But, I mean, how can I not be excited, man? Legends! A free legend? I have the opportunity to get a free legend, and it's just by playing a few games in single-player tournaments or whatever you want to call it, not to mention a special kit as well. Now, on this series, we have managed to get all of the special kits other than the Division 1 kit. There's only been one other special kit, but we've managed to get all of the other special kits already. So, the yellow tournament kit we're wearing right now, the beautiful all-white legend kit at this point and we get to call it we've just unlocked so i would highly recommend you guys do this if you're watching this video now even if you're watching this video two three four days after i've uploaded it this tournament is still going on right now and for a poor man road to glory this is a very 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 good tournament to grind out because i don't have any confirmation on this but i'll show you guys it's a progressive tournament so the first win you just get the legend kit but we get a lone legend pack which is incredible and I think we're going to use, I hope to God it's not a shit legend because we're trying to win Division 1 in this episode. I think we're going to use them in our newest squad builder. Now, I think if I click through here, let me just block this because I think it's going to just show a bunch of stuff that I don't want to show you guys. Um, but the other thing why I love doing these tournaments is right now I have the thousand coin unlock. So every game I play, like this game, I got 1,563 coins for playing 10 minutes of FIFA. Already that's incredible for the poor man Road to Glory. So I'm super, super excited about that. But I got to show you guys a few things here. So this tournament, I don't think we're going to include me grinding this tournament in the actual recording. Um, right now, if we win the tournament again, we get another 2,000 coins. I've heard that if you win the tournament after that, you get 5,000 coins and then maybe you get 8,000 or 10,000 coins. That's what I'm seeing float around on Twitter right now. I have no confirmation of that, but... I'm going to grind out the tournament at least one more time to see what the next prize is after the 2,000 coin prize. But, I mean, come on, man. I'm a big nerd for stuff like this, so why would I not want to go with yet another special kit? So we got the Ultimate Team third kit. We now have the Legends home kit. And there's actually about five or six other special kits that now I think EA is going to start releasing throughout the summer. Hopefully in online tournaments, because that would just make it a little bit more intense and awesome for this series where we try and win them from online tournaments but we've got a lot of stuff to win so i want to quickly show you guys the next phase so there it is 2000 coins so i'll do this all offline what we want to do today is do a squad builder now i've sold off my players i lost as you guys can see i've made no coins i cashed out patrick clivert and all those players i lost not a lot to be fair i actually patrick clivert went up in price we bought him for what was it 395 or 405 or something i ended up selling patrick cliver for 440 something like that unfortunately like a pleb as i was getting prepared for for this for this uh recording i cleared it out like an idiot i just did it by accident i tapped lb or whatever and i totally cleared everything out so i'm sorry that i couldn't this is the first time i think ever that i haven't been able to show you guys like me selling off all the other past players i'll try not to make that mistake again um but trust me that i lost coins on pretty much all the players even patrick cliver uh, I think at the end of the day, we still lost a few thousand coins on, but that's all right. We've been grinding the tournaments. We have a whole bunch of coin unlocks right now, um, that allow us to do relatively well in the, um, in the, in the form of generating coins. So we're good there. Now, let me clear out all of this. We built this team for the tournament and I think I'm going to actually keep this team so that I can just go right back into 
I should have probably put it in tournaments, but let's do whatever. Who cares about the title? Um, this is going to be the team that we build, the new divisions team, if you will, for our divisions run. So let me show you guys as well. If you missed last episode, some things are getting spoiled for you. If you don't want more things to be spoiled, pause the episode, this episode, go watch the last episode because it was a good one. Um, and look how we're doing in Division 1. So, not very great, but the dream is still technically alive to win Division 1. We just have to win every single game going from here. So, we need to win five in a row in today's episode. And I am going to complete this Division's run in today's episode. So, we're either going to be relegated and having broken a few controllers or staying in Divisions, which I'll be, you know, probably still irritated with, but relatively happy that we've held Division 1. Or insanely hyped up because we've won Division 1 on the first time of asking, which I don't think is possible, but who knows? You know what, man? You know, people have had bigger dreams and achieved them. So my dream is to win Division 1. We're going to do it. So there are Division 1 stats as well. Not bad, I would have to say. Not bad at all. We've looked at these uh, a couple of episodes ago as well. And you know what? Playing through Division 1 and Division 2, our stats haven't gone too bad. So let's get going on this new team. Now, I have an idea in my head of how I want to build this team. I want to try and build an effective Division 1 team. And I do want to try and include this free legend in the team. I just hope that it's a half-decent one. If I get, like, DeBoer or... Lalas isn't bad, to be fair. But, like, I, if I get a complete crap legend, like, like no offense, Valderrama, something like that. I don't know if I'm going to include him in the squad builder for a Division 1 run. We'll use Valderrama or whatever legend we get here. But I need a top quality legend. Come on, EA. Poor man Road to Glory. We haven't given you any money, so technically we don't deserve you helping us out. But feel free! Who? 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 That's great! Yo, Alan Shearer is a fantastic pull. Now, we only get him for three games, but... Hmm. Do we start... Imagine we got Hullet or something like that. Now, the question is, do we start the squad builder around him and we put him up at striker? I think so. Because I was going to build a... I was going to do a squad builder around a striker. Another striker. So maybe now we can toss in... Maybe like a legendary center attacking mid or something like that. Yo, that's... I'm, I'm actually really, really down with that. That's good. I've actually seen people tweet me... Them opening this loan pack... And getting an inform bronze in the loan pack as well. I don't know how people get that lucky, but... So let's toss Shearer up at striker. Um... I'm now, you know what? Now I have a de tough decision to make because in my head I had an idea around a legend striker that I wanted to build a team around. We've already used Shearer, as you guys know, in, in the Poor Man Road to Glory, but I think I could make myself a pretty darn cool team. And uh, remember this guy from years past? This guy used to be crazy expensive. Oh, all these dudes are untradeable. Okay, well that's all right. You know what? Not necessarily going to use any of them. Football League 1, I can't see myself using someone from Antigua. Um, but that's okay. We'll toss them all in the club. Never know. Maybe there'll be some feature tournaments out there that we'll need, uh, need some of those players from. So never discard. If it's a poor man road to glory, never discard free untradeable players. Just put them in your club. You never know when you're going to need them. So I honestly think I'm going to go boring. I do think I'm going to go boring. The problem is with this formation, as you guys know, for the last few episodes, I've stuck with this formation because I feel like it's actually pretty good. It requires me to play well for me to succeed incredibly well with, but it's a very, very good formation. And there's, you know, there's got to be a reason why most people I see in Division 1 use this formation. It's because it's effective. So I'm going to stick with it. And the problem was, is I was thinking of doing like a sweaty, overpowered Serie A team. A Division 1 team, if you will. Um, but I just don't know about the wingers in the Serie A. There's not that many incredible ones. Now, you know, Insigne is not bad. Mohamed Salah, I like quite a bit but in terms of other leagues like we could go premier league and just have an incredibly well-rounded team for relatively cheap uh the bundesliga again we could do the bundesliga again and have an incredibly well-rounded team for very very cheap league uh, maybe not so much so the debate is what route do i want to go do i want to go with what i know and we just go premier league and go relatively cheap because I think what we're going to do here is this is all going to be regular players and when Shearer expires this episode, so we're going to get three games out of him, for our final two games we're going to get a new Legend Striker that I'm not going to tell you guys about because if I do, people are just going to start buying that Legend card um, and making him too expensive or yeah, I was about to say her, 
There's no females, not an ultimate team at least, which is... I would love to know people's thoughts on that, you know? Or maybe there's legalities behind not putting females into the game. So, hmm. I'm thinking, I'm thinking... Yeah, and, and then the other thought is too, I don't want to go in forms. I don't want to go in forms right now because inform people are losing heavy money on informs. Like I'm talking heavy money on informs right now. Um, so I don't want to go informs. You know, I don't want to risk going like buying an inform Willian, right? And we use him for a little bit and EA surprises us today or something and releases a team of the season and pr his price just, just plummets. I need to be safe. We have over 600,000 coins now in the club. We got to be safe with our coins. So what non-informed league can we put together that would work well? I don't want to go for a hybrid. I I'm going to stick to a league. Hmm. If I hybrid, I need to remember that I am going to have another legend in here as well. Let me see here. You know what? In terms of right wingers is going to be the decision maker, I think. Let's go look at... Uh, let's go look at what we have in concepts. And that's going to help me choose... Oh my god. Okay, so none of this lovely <laughs> stuff. Max, thank you so much for two months in a row, dude. Appreciate it. You know what? Let me move this up ever so slightly so it's not, like, completely in the way. There we go. I mean, it's still going to be in the way, but it's not completely in the way. Um, Silva, no. You know what? You know what? That's a great point. That is a great... Ooh... That is a great point. How cheap is this card? How cheap is this card? This might be the only super expensive card I buy, but how cheap is how cheap are you? I think his regular card would make an absolutely fantastic center attacking mid. How cheap are you, Slotan? What? An 89 rated Zlatan Ibrahimovic is is 60,000 coins? Did I see that correctly, or was I tripping balls? Was it 160,000 coins? I'm pretty sure I saw 60... There's no way. Let's just double check here. What? Holy Jesus! 56,500 coins, and he's got a Hunter Chem style on him. 56,000... That... Shocks me. I honestly, because I don't think of, I just didn't think of buying Zlatan for the longest time because I still thought he was relatively expensive. I didn't want to put all of my money into that type of a card when you could get, you know, a legend for a little bit more. Not to say that Zlatan isn't a legend, but oh my god, I I am I'm shocked. I'm shocked. So we need a striker to center forward card, and actually, I think me paying for that conversion, I probably make my money back as well, um, because I do believe that. Zlatan at Cam, at least his regular card, is probably the best place for him. He's a little bit slow at striker, and I think you can use a lot of his other attributes um, at center attacking mid. So we'll go position change. Let's see how much this is. I think these are relatively expensive. Oh, God. I really hope... I, I need to remember when I list up this card that I put money into position change. I need to remember that. It's not that bad. 1300 so I'll have to list them for 59 You know, 59 k He's got a Hunter Chem style, so I think it's going to be doable. Maybe I might even get one for a thousand. No? All right. 1100 is what it is. It's not the end of the world. Um, now, the question is, do we keep him at center forward so that he's usable even in a false nine setup? He should get full chem um, in this setup as well. All right. I need to... Oh, man. I don't know if I'm screwing myself here, dudes. I don't know if I'm screwing myself here or not. Am I just build? Am I? Are we? Are we now just building? I guess we're building a hybrid. Okay, whatever. You know what? I still think I can build a very effective hybrid. Um. Oh, did I miss a cam one? No, you're kidding. I didn't miss a cam one, did I? Did I miss a cam one? <laughs> Shut up. I didn't. Oh God. Hold on. I already applied that center for. Oh no. Oh no. The abuse in the comments is gonna be real. You played yourself, Nick2018! Oh no. Come on. Don't don't be don't be that guy. Did I actually? Let's see. What are you guys talking about? I didn't miss one. I missed you guys are saying I missed one for 57? No. Unless it's sold already. Yo, I want proof. I'm gonna check this out. I am going to check it out. As I'm editing the video, and I'm gonna put a screamer sound right after this if there wasn't a cam one. <laughs> 
for 57. That's what's gonna happen. And probably now your ears have been melted, so congratulations. Um, all right, so, and I think here, the only, the only option, honestly, is for a left-sided... Ooh, I have some ideas. I don't think these guys are gonna be super expensive. Uh, where are you, Blaze? Where are you, Blaze? 84... There it is. So Ibra now will be on full cam. I can do a completely different right side of the field. Uh, and what I, I what I consider will be an overpowered right side of the field as well. What? I thought it, uh, I thought it like saves it into here. So what am I doing? I am drunk. I am drunk, but not drunk. <laughs> I am drunk, but not drunk. Uh, all right. So we'll see if we pay, what was it? So cheap. So cheap, man. Now, I don't need him to be a center mid, but you know what? That will help resale if I sneak a center mid one or just buy a center mid one. Although, to be fair, I think center mid to CDMs are relatively expensive, so I can't be I can't see someone being an idiot. Oh my god, yes they are. The biggest idiots ever. 2,000 coins. Damn, son. Okay. Um, well, let's see. Okay, that's all there is. So 1700 is the cheapest. Let's look at 1800 because uh, I'm trying to get the cheapest possible center mid version. I don't want to play myself again. Anything for 1800? There's so many up. Oh God, I thought I saw one for as a center mid. Damn it. Uh, if I miss one, you know what? It's because I'm blind. I don't think I've seen one yet. Oh God. No, okay, those are all center mids. Okay. And the other one was 2,000? Was it 2,000? God, we're doing this for 100 coins when I have 550k. But honestly, that is the reason why I have 550k. It's because I'm such a, like, stickler for this type of stuff. This is how I manage to, like, constantly save up coins. Because I always try and buy the cheapest version. I mean, we may have screwed up on Ebra a little bit there. Um, but for the most part, I always try and buy the cheapest one. No, there isn't. Um... Yeah, that, you know what would be really intelligent as well as if we did this? What a virgin. What a virgin I am. No, okay. Let's just do this. Watch my the one for 2,000 be sold. No, okay, there's endless amounts up for 2,000. Okay, that's good too. That's good too, because look, now we can get one with an engine chem style for 2,000 coins and position changed. Thank God I came up with that idea. God, I should be face palming myself right now. No! Guess what? I still haven't taken this shit out of the playlist. Guess what we're doing right now? Spotify, Control F, save me now. There it is. Get the frick out of the playlist. Remove from playlist. Bye. Fist yourself. Thank God. I've officially removed it from the playlist. Oh my god, that's the worst song ever. <laughs> Thank god, man. There are people in the comments also saying, Oh my god, I can't believe Nick, every time he, he records these videos, he says he wants to take it out of the playlist, but never does. Well, it's out now, okay? It's gone. God, this recording's gonna take us 12 years to do. So, I think we're gonna do a French link here. We're definitely not doing leak. Uh, well, and Tep wouldn't be too bad, actually. But I think we're gonna do... Am I gonna go boring? Am I gonna go boring and go French and then loop in like one solid league, whatever that league may be? You know, we've got a few options, whether we use the French players in La Liga to go that route, whether we use French players in the Premier League to go that route. I just honestly think that that's gonna be a good way to go. Now, an effective winger. I loved using this card. I just can't remember how much he was. Anyone else remember how much this card is, is or was? I would go Komen, don't get me wrong. I would go Komen, but he's 33k. I need to remember as well the player that I need, need to buy as a replacement here. So maybe I do go Komen. What other French wingers are there in the game? Actually, that would be effective. And Tep would, honestly, I might, instead of Komen, I might go in Tep. So we got Komen. Where is Intep? Komen's got 69 passing set. We're talking Division 1, bros. He has 3 star, 3 star. That's pretty goddamn awful. I gotta be real. I know that there's a lot of Komen fans out there. In real life, I respect it. I think he's fantastic. But I mean, 
How can I? Nah, 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 nah. We're not going Komen. You guys are, you guys are crazy, man. I love you, but you're crazy. Um, all right. So two thousand. Let me see if we can snag one. Um, as a position change as well. Um, here we go. So two thousand was the average, I think, for him as a left mid, right? Let's see what we can get. I don't know. I don't know if that's a good play or not. I have no idea if that's a good play. I just jumped on it. I just jumped on that. I, we haven't used this card in, in the poor man Road to Glory, I don't think. But you look at those cards, those stats, the four star, four star. I think in Division 1, he's going to be hell of a lot better than Komen. Did I screw myself there? 1700 for him, right? We said 1700. Let's look at, let's look at the regular version. No, we did, we did super good. That's the one that I bought. Why is it still there? No, we did super, super good. Position change for the same cheapness of a non-position changed one. Super good. Okay. Now, boring or not boring? That is the question. Boring or not boring? Now, none of these guys need, need a link. So I could go super, super link here. Official, thank you so much for the resubscribe or for the first time sub. Joey, thank you for nine months. And Max, thank you for the two months as well, dude. I appreciate it. So who can we get a super link out of anyways? Um, oh God, the Justin Bieber baby baby. Um, who can I use? This song is obnoxious. But anyways, it's for our Twitch baby. So it makes sense. Do I go super link or do we just go boring? I think we... I think the good play is to go boring. It needs to be an effective team. Effective good team. We could go Kurzawa. We could go Kurzawa. We could go Kurzawa. We could go Kurzawa. Kurzawa is a god. He really is. We could go Kur We could go Kurzawa and then we've got whatever we want, really. Um I mean, we could go Patrice Ever as well and link into yet another league, which is kind of what I was thinking of doing. Um, yeah, that, that, that is definitely what I was thinking of doing. Um, I don't know, man. I do not know what route I want to go here. Let's see what center, uh, do we go safe? I think we go, I think we go safe. We need good center backs. We do need good center backs. Can I get this to work? Okay, I have an idea. I have something in my head that just came through. Um, I do have something in my head that just came through. I don't have a super link there, do I? No, but I do have something in my head that just came through. Okay, so this is the route that we're gonna go. We're gonna get Kurzawa over here. Um, Liven Kurzawa. Just get his regular card. Regular card's awesome. He's gonna get, I'm assuming, a team of the season pretty damn soon. So that'll be an incredible card that we will undoubtedly test out. Um, how much are you? So you're 1700 so far. Let's see what we're looking at here. Let's see if we can get him for around a thousand. No. 1300, no. 1400, no. Really? So that was the cheapest one? Okay. Just a million listed up for 1700. All right. Um, so much for sniping. So let's see if we can get an anchor. Perfect. I'm just buying it. Anchor Kem style, so he's up to like 81, 82 pace. That's good. That's solid. And then I've got an idea for the back line as well. I'm going to go overpowered, strong, beautiful partnership. I haven't tried it in Division 1, to be fair. But I feel like it should go well. On my main account, this player carried me to a Division 1 title. I, I don't know. I, I'm very like pessimistic about this run because five wins in a row... Especially when our first game online today is going to be in a must-win Division 1 game right off the bat. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, but if there's someone that's going to help carry me across the line, it will be Leno. The regular Leno. The Inform's fine, but his, the regular card is overpowered as it is. Um, and I'm not going to really... You guys know I'm not going to sit here trying to snipe players. As much as I want to, it would just make these recordings insane long. So, okay, 2100. If I can just get one for 2,000, I'm alright. Okay, perfect. Uh, do we need to worry about, like, wall or stupid stuff like that? 
What does wall give you again? Eh, whatever. Helps us out a little bit. Why not? Beautiful. So he's in the team. Now I'm wondering, do you guys know who I'm going to be going for here? I, don't, I think you're going to get one of them, but the other one's going to be an odd choice. I, I, I really hope... Oh no, it can't be an odd choice. No! Damn! I bottled it already. I did, didn't I? Did I bottle this already? What a tip. I did. I did. Okay. Alright, well, let's just go with the original plan and see if I can, uh... See if I can... See if I can save this. Jerome. There you are. Um, how much is Jerome on average so we know what to search? 20. I honestly don't know if we're going to be able to afford the legend that I want, man. I gotta be... I gotta be really, really careful. I'm in my head. I know how much I want to spend total, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Jim, thank you for two months as well, dude. Appreciate it. Um, could you use Ta? I'm not going to use Ta. No. The upgraded Ta or whatever? No, I'm not. I'm not. Sorry. I want to go with, like, guys that I know are going to be good. Um, and unfortunately, Ta isn't going to fit. All right. There was one. There's a shadow. Oh, it's gone anyways. You know what? Let me just go buy that shadow then for 250 coins more. That's fine. I'm right with that. No, idiot. There it is. Perfect. 250 coins more to get a shadow chem style. I'm right with that. Okay. So, right center back. Right center back. What route do we want to go? Um, now, there's a there, there are a decent few options. There are a decent few options here. Um... I'm going to need a strong link to Boatang. That's the only issue. Now, we could put Boatang over here and go with, you know, a different, um, a, uh, a, a, a league, uh, center back, but I don't want to do that. As much as I like David Luiz, I do like David Luiz. I do like, I do like David Luiz. I had an idea in my head and I bottled it. I would have needed Neuer to make this work. And I don't want to spend that much on Neuer because then I won't be able to afford this gentleman. Uh, or, or the replacement for this gentleman, which is unfortunate. Um, so, because of that, this guy is still fantastic, if I'm honest. Uh, and there's still, uh, there's still good options. There's still good options. Could go with Hummels. Um, but I'd rather go with someone that matches the work rates with, uh, Boatang. And these two, as a non-rare, uh, a non-informed combo, are probably the best center-back partnership in... Well, one of the best center-back partnerships in terms of non-rare combinations. Um, they both just play so well together and watch me just get sh melted the first game uh, in divisions but in the past these guys have both been pretty damn good for me and look at this an 84 rated card that I'm gonna pay what 950 950 coins for ridiculous ridiculous absolutely ridiculous okay and then from here I was thinking of doing something a little bit different but again I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it work which kind of pisses me off um, no, I can't make it happen. Oh, no, I can make it happen. Oh, hell yeah. Come on, Pleb 28T. I can make it happen. Okay. Um, uh, we're going to go with this beautiful man. Uh, no one uses him. No one uses this card. Just his regular card, and he's fantastic. He really is. I discovered that from the Fatal series. Uh, not that I went very far in the Fatal series, if I'm completely honest, but, um, he was so good, man. And he, you know what? I mean, I won in the Fatal series against the YouTuber that I played. Uh, if you haven't watched that video, you should. It's probably one of the best games of FIFA I've ever played. Um, the return leg, I didn't play that great. But, uh, how much? You like 5k or something like that? I think I'm still within my budget, so this is good. 4,500, alright. See what the cheapest one is. 4,200. So it is 4,000? Okay, so it is 4,000. Alright, that's in, in the range of the cheapest. So let's see how much I'm going to have to pay for a right wing version. There's one for 4,100, right? Perfect. Love it. Love it. 100 coins more and we get a right wing version? Uh, I'm down. I'm down. So that's the route I wanted to go. Now, I'm gonna need some magic. This is actually turning into a turning into turning into a somewhat half decent 
a uh, little hybrid, nothing crazy, but pretty decent setup. So over here, the man that ran away for the money, I don't blame him. I really don't blame him. Everyone hates him for it, but I don't blame him. Um, a footy career is very, very limited. Someone that isn't in the top one percentile or 0.001 percentile of best players in the world who will make crazy money anywhere, like Ramirez, why not, dude? Why not go to go to China and earn money that Ronaldo makes? Why wouldn't you? I know I would. I know I would. And I'm sure that if you were a pro footballer, all those people that are footy fans or football fans of Chelsea or whatever saying, no, I would stay for the loyalty of, the, of my club. I don't know, man. I'm going to cause probably a hell of a lot of drama in my comment section, but I would bet that 99% of people would go for the money. You can't blame footballers for looking for their like looking towards their future and their family's futures, man. Um, oh wow. Oh yeah, I guess he doesn't really. I don't know if he's. Is he not in packs anymore? Oh shit. That's a lot of money. Did they did they actually take him out of packs? I don't know that. I don't know the answer to that. I would assume, all things considered, like if he was still in packs, he'd probably be like two three thousand coins. And a center mid. Cheapest one as a center mid. We are living the dream. Okay. And then the right back is another one as a center mid. Wait, was I looking for him as a center mid? What? Or was that just the one that I bought reappearing on the market? Je ne sais pas. Que sera, sera. Whatever will be, will be. And that's a perfect segue into my next player. Ha! <laughs> Wait, wrong one. Oh, God. Oh, God. We, we bottled it. Oh, no. Oh, Lord. There you go. Que sera, sera. Ha <laughs> ha! That segue, though. Um, all right. I'm assuming he's still, like, 500 coins or something. Oh, he's gone up as well? Not by much. I'll take that for 650. And there it is! The team is ready. And how much did we actually spend on it? Not much, right? 70k? 75k? No, more. No, almost 100k. What am I talking about? Uh, yeah, just under 100k. Like 95,000 coins is what we've what we've spent on this team. That's not bad. For for what we put together, for what I think is going to be a competitive Division One team, 95,000 coins. So that's basically a 100k Division One squad builder that we just did. And then we're gonna spend the big money on uh, well, and we did spend pretty much all of our money, half of it, more than half of it on Zlatan. But that's the team. I think that's great. Does it need... It needs a bit of fitness in certain places, which is fine. We do the bronze pack method a lot. So we have fitness cards ready to roll. Um, so we'll do that one. Who else? We'll do... We'll do you, Benatia. We will do you. So undoubtedly, we will be doing the bronze pack method a few times this episode. I can guarantee that. Which I know you guys like. So that will be included in it. Look out for it. Um, what else do we got? Anyone else that's low? Willian, I can get one more game out of him. And then we'll bring in some super subs as well. 84 rated squad already. So who are we going to bring in as a super sub? A winger that can just be brought on as a sub is a good play. Um, uh, I do already have Moreno, but we're using him for the tournament. He would be good to bring on, though, honestly, as, as a sub for pace. Uh, Hacken, for sure. Lukaku has that super sub as well. Um... And then, do I have, like, a half-decent defender in case one of my players... Oh, Carlos Tevez. Why wouldn't I... What? Why wouldn't I be using Carlos Tevez as a super sub? Um, instead of Lukaku. Sorry, Romelu. Uh, and a defensive-minded midfielder. There we go. And you know what? I can sub on Kadira as, as... Okay, so let's take out Lukaku. Sorry, Brew. There it is. And you know what? Tevez can be used as a cam as well if I need it. I only want, like, three super subs in the team. Uh, trying... I don't know that it exists or not, but trying to keep my squad rating down to see if I can get a little bit of that, like, scripting, you know, handicapping help or whatever you want to call it from EA. That would be nice. <laughs> Anything that can help me win, I am down for. So we'll go with the lowest rated players. Here we go. This is the dream right here. Boom. This doesn't help. This is all placebo, honestly. This is all just in my head, but it, it makes me feel good. It makes me feel good to do it. So there we go. We got an 80 rated squad. That's the team. Let's get into this Division 1 run. I can only assume that this, this portion of the squad building probably took me like 40 minutes. This video could easily be an hour and a half long. All right, we're playing a foot founder right now. Yeah, it is, oh my, it is what it is. That's an effective team as well, isn't it? That is a very effective team as well. All right, worried about Benzema, worried about Jesse Rodriguez. Honestly, out of everyone there, Jesse Rodriguez is going to be the most lethal for this guy. I can almost guarantee you. 
Shearer, please! Oh! Went silent there. I was hoping it would open up so I could shoot across body. Um, because those are super, super overpowered, but just wasn't happening. So let's see if we can get Boateng. There you go, the unfair advantage button. Who is that, though? Is that Hesse versus Boateng this time? That's also a good matchup. Boateng! Son of an ass! Come on, boys. I feel like I put all the pressure on, but to be fair, I don't think I've really had that many shots. Um, so I'd love to see what the halftime stats look like. You know what? Please, can we just at least go into the half? Um, drawn, please. End of the half is near. It is near and it is here. Come on, Ibra. That's nice having Ibra in the middle, actually. Uh, for my own corners. What are you doing? Where are you going with this? Using Luka Modric. Is he going short? No. Just doing that to pull players away. Fair enough. Come on. Hello. Come on. Hi. What happened? I fell down the stairs. You fell down the stairs? I You're delivering me food, though. That's good. I You're usually a good luck charm. You didn't spill. You I fell down the stairs but didn't spill that sandwich? No, I decided to twist my knee instead of... You twisted your knee instead of spilling the sandwich. I appreciate the commitment to being a top wife, though. Thank you, babe. You're my lucky charm, though. Oh, I thought I was going to score there. Thank you, Steph. And there it is. Halftime again. It's like every video now. I literally am showing you guys myself being delivered food. So that's a whole wheat mini bun with a chicken patty in there. Um, and there are fries that are incredibly soggy and gross, but don't tell Steph. So I'm probably not going to eat the fries. I will eat the, the turkey, or sorry, the chicken whole wheat burgers, though. All right, let's have a look. See, what? I just finished saying that I feel like I've had all the pressure. I feel like I was in his own end the entire time. What a ball. What a ball. Please, Ibra. Oh, you asshole, De Gea. And Ibra's injured now. Great. I'm just spend a freaking healing card on him after this game, man. Kurzawa, that's an AIDS touch, but... Come on, Zlatan. Oh, putting the pressure on now. I do have to say, though, I really do enjoy Ibra. Uh, as a cam. I wonder how his team of the season would play as a cam. Uh, okay, tap. Here we go, come on. Third time's a charm. Third time lucky. That's a great fucking ball! Yes! There it is, boys! Third time lucky indeed! That matchup at the near post. If I was my opponent, I would lose my mind. Because every time I switch my player, it gives me Boateng on the near post against one of his small-ass players. This time it was Jesse Rodriguez. one nothing, boys! Oh my god. The belief. The belief has to be there. It has to. Freaking has to be there. We need to win every single freaking game. I was about to say that I need to start deciding when I'm going on ultra attacking. Well, now, not yet anyways. This guy scores right. Ref, please. That's a foul for him? Okay. All right. This is where, this is where squeaky bum time happens. Squeepy, squeepy? Squeaky bum time. What a pass by Zlatan. Come on. There's no way PK should be making ground on me. No, oh, De Gea, you bastard face. Okay. And Tep, Matuidi. Oh, so many chances now. Come on. I don't know how Matuidi got that accurate of a, sh of a shot off, honestly. Come on. Nope. No. No. No, no. If he scored... No, fuck you, Modric, you ass. That guy just shot all over me with one player. His Luka Modric literally, and that took a deflection as well. Right down the field after I had chance after chance after chance. That's actually a pretty sick ball. Holy shit, please get there. Oh, that was a really good ball. God. Are crossfield passes a thing still? I remember they used to be super overpowered. I can't remember what year. FIFA 14 maybe? Maybe FIFA 13? That's a problem. That is an insane pass. That is a big, that's a goal. That's a loss. Division one, ladies and gentlemen, right there. I can't explain it better than that. The Div one title is dead, right there. Like I said, draw or loss, it's the same. The Div one title would be dead, so. 
Just make me look good, Ebro. Come on, man. Come on. Unreal, man. Unreal. Uh, second half, I feel like I have come good, though. I've created a hell of a lot of chances, so there's that to be happy about. Now Ebro's near post. Okay. That's too near post. <laughs> what the hell? Oh my god. This guy's conceded off of two corners. Oh my. Can we all just pause the music there to just say RIP and pepperonis for what just happened? Imagine this guy needs a wing to win Division 1, and that happens. Wow! Oh my god! Is that the end? Oh my god, dude. I mean, honestly, I feel like I should have just scored an own goal. Because the draw doesn't matter. I'm losing Division 1, my Division 1 title hopes. I probably should have just went and scored an own goal for that guy. I didn't even think of that. Because a, a draw doesn't help me out. Who knows? That guy may have needed a win. You know? Little bit of class in Division 1. I'm trying to bring it to Division 1. But whatever. We fluked our way into a freaking draw. My god. So we need a win and a draw from the next four games. That's what we need. That's a nice team. Good formation. One of my other more favorite formations. It's probably not going to work for me this way, but I can at least rest assured that his midfield is insanely attacking, whereas I think mine is a little bit stronger and more balanced. Now, for some reason, people that use insanely attacking players everywhere on the pitch seem to actually do well against me because I just get overwhelmed in defense and never can really counterattack well enough. Um, but we'll see. we'll see how that changes. Stupid, stupid, man. Like, I, I didn't have any, like, my player didn't have the, didn't have the jump, didn't have anything, and I still went for the shot. Shearer was in all sorts of, like, out of positionness, if you will. Yeah, oh, oh, please, please, what a play! Yes! God, all I gotta do is criticize myself more. It's like when I criticize players and they start doing well. I am not enjoying Shearer again. I've been reminded by my viewers that I didn't like Shearer the first time we used him, and honest to God, I didn't. I don't like him the second time. I can't. He's just nowhere to be seen anywhere ever. Zlatan at Cam, on the other hand, is fantastic. Here we go. Now all we we need we we I I, I don't have to be too upset yet. I can get a draw from one of these games as well and still stay in Division One. So it'd be nice to just get the win out of the way here. I don't really think I deserve to be in the lead this game, but I'll take it. That that goes out of bounds for a corner. I'll, I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Just see if we can get to halftime. Baby steps. Ibra, please. Ibra, please with that touch, man. Ibra, please with that touch. That's a problem. That is a big problem. Okay, just cut off the lane. Cut off the lane. It's okay. We can't score this. The angle's impossible. Well done. Well done, Benatia. Absolutely impossible angle. Is he going short, though? Nope. It's happening here. Yes, Boatang. Go out for a throw-in, too. Yeah! Okay, bottle it, bottle it, bottle it. Okay, he did bottle it. Who? What the foul to Ebra? No, just end the half, please. Please just end the half for the love of all that is holy. That's a problem. Yeah, end the half. Honestly, man, I can't. Leno is just insane. Leno, that was a terrible save in terms of it almost looked like it deflected in, but Leno's keeping me in this. Sh Leno was so good. Oh god, just end it! It's been two minutes about in time for about 45 hours! Oh my god, my brain. Holy lord. Getting that goal, man, has just added so much extra pressure to this team. So here we are, halftime. Everything's pretty even, but I do gotta say, it feels like this game, my opponent is the one that's putting a hell of a lot more pressure on me right now. Long shots. You know what? Honestly, this is probably a simple thing for most people. But I think I've realized that Zlatan at Cam is the way forward. Zlatan at Cam is outrageous. Ibra, I love you. Have my babies. Oh, 
my god, Kaylor Navas! 2 nothing still, boys! Whoo! Okay, um, I do not want Shearer taking this. I want him to be in the box. And who's gonna come short? Ha! <laughs> who's gonna come to me? Oh my god, there's no one covering Boateng now. Oh no, Ramos stepped up for it. That's goal kick. Okay, alright. Ten minutes to go, I would say, with, uh, with extra time. There should be some sort of extra time. That's mine. Has to be. Okay. Good. No, God, come on, Nick. It's mine. Just kidding. Still mine. Keeper. There we go. Up to and tap. Here we go. Okay, that was eight. Pretty sure Leno has 81 goal kicks. Yes! Great defending. Shearer, go on a run, buddy. Come on, Shearer! Shearer, you don't do anything ever! Give me some sort of relief! You know? Stop blue balling me, bro! There we go. Patience, 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 patience. Turn back. There it is. Tislatan. Ramirez running through. Ramirez is 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 is, is like it's just unreal. Ramirez is fantastic, man. No wonder he's so expensive. Whether he's in or out of packs, he's that's an idiotic play. Oh god, oh god, there's still plenty of time. Yeah, he's got three minutes of added time. Shit, this is my fault. It's all my fault. Come on. Composure, Nick. Composure. Oh, we got this. We got this. We got this. If we could get this win, man, it makes the last three games relatively comfortable because all I need is a draw to stay in Division 1. And that's all I want. Oh, ho, ho, ho. we got this. I think that's it. Uh, come on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play this short. Here we go. Just stay safe, man. Okay, take a touch and... Nope, that's dumb. That is so dumb, but that should be the end of the game. Has to be. Yes, boys! Oh, man! If only I put together a better performance in that first game or whatever, the first game of Divisions, the Div 1 winning dream would still be alive. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, so no surprises there. From the first half, Leno was fantastic. Uh, does deserve man of the match. How many saves did he make? He made nine saves. His Navas made six saves. Again, look at the rating of my opponents, though, compared to the rating of my team. I totally deserve that. Ebro with a goal and an assist. God, am I ever loving having him in the club again. Let's have a quick look at the uh, at the stats as well, based off of the end of the game. So I think we did good. It was, it was a well-split game. Uncharacteristically, I finished my chances more than my opponent did. So just to reiterate here, we need one point from the last... Uh, this song's okay. It's not too bad. We need one point from the last three games. I better make that happen. I would love to have the 7,500 coins. And you know what? We'll just try again. This is what this series is all about. It's not like we're going to, you know, succeed everything in the first try. Record's still doing great. Um, but I do need a few fitness cards. So I think I'm going to open, like, four or five uh, bronze packs. And, ooh. Ooh, what are these promos? Ooh, 35Ks. 15Ks. <laughs> not something we can dabble in, unfortunately. Come on. Come on. Come on, I'll take a big player. Help boost our coins a little bit, EA. Okay, well, they they uh, they uh obliged. So this Luzier may or may not sell. Some of these players just end up selling because um, people are looking to put them on their bench and stuff like that. I don't, don't see any of those selling. So that is actually... Oh, 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 the manager. Sell him. He'll sell for sure. For the most part, managers sell. I find the only issue I have is the Spanish managers do not sell. That's a weird one for me. <laughs> um. Oh! Wow! Oh my god, that came out of freaking nowhere! Bronze pack method OP! Not only one silver, two silvers, and a rare silver at that, and it's Anderson, X-Man United player. Like, it's not a completely crap silver. Let's see if he sells. Yo, bronze pack method OP, baby. Oh. 1900... I just made 1,800 coins from the bronze back method. That's sick. I'm actually tempted to maybe use them. Not in Division 1, though. Sorry, Anderson. If I can get 1,800 coins for you, dude. Bronze pack method OP, baby. All right, so we'll toss them up. The cheapest on the market is 1,800. Um, I would be shocked if this Dominguez guy sold, if I'm honest. But let's have a look. No. Ah, you know what? He might sell for 200. If he doesn't, I'll discard him for 100. No big deal. Uh, 40 rated bronze players all sell. I need to double check and see if he just sells for 200 or if it's... Okay, so it's only 200. But he'll sell. 
Thought I'd relist him a bunch of times. This is a great pack, actually. No, uh, no, no, no things that we need. That mustache, though. Good God. What a beautiful thing that is. Come on. Come on. Give me that fitness. Oh, no. Was it 1,200? Oh, I thought it was 1,900. Was it 1,200? So, I mean, 1,100 or 1,000 coins? All right. Well, he'll probably go on bid for under 1,000 then. Fuck sakes. That's, that's shit. I thought it was 1,900. My bad. My bad. Um... Toss this up for 200. McGregor is retired. I think it's a troll, honestly. I don't think that's a real tweet. I really do not think that's a real tweet. I think that's a straight up troll. How? I don't know. I, again, I, I don't understand his current situation. So maybe it makes sense for him to retire. To me, uh, as an outsider looking in, uh, it doesn't make sense at all. But what the hell do I know? All right. So you know what? I, that was actually it. I thought I needed more... Oh my, that's a terrible card. I thought I needed more fitness cards, but you know what? We did good. We got Anderson, who is going to sell for probably seven or 800 coins, not 1,900. But anyways, let's get into, hopefully, the final game of this run in Division. I hope I don't bottle it. Have a crap team. Be crap. Oh God, no. No, that's an insanely overpowered Divisions team is what that is. Oh, that Perea. That's the one. Perea and Dybala. I'm really, really concerned about. Watch Doombia just shit all over my team, but uh, honestly, out of those three, it's not Doombia that worries me. Really, it's Perea. That card is lights out awesome. I say lights out awesome very often now. Thought that was a good idea. Nope. This guy's just got pace everywhere, eh? This guy's double teaming everything right now. What a blee! Oh, no! No bullshit! Oh, come on! How does Zebra hit the freaking post there? Look at this, man. This is all I'm dealing with so far. Just counter attack. Wow, man. Oh, my. I thought that was in for sure. The, the way that pass worked out. The way that pass worked out. I was convinced that I was in on net. Or that was in the net. It's not going to happen, bros. Is that a foul? Okay, I'll take that. I don't know how that's a foul. I don't know how that's a foul, but... Come on, just a draw. 38 yards. Can Ibra make something happen with this? Holy God! Alright, let's try Shearer then. I didn't realize he had those stats. That might be too much power. Oh! Alan Shearer! Of course! I've been bitching and moaning about him this entire episode. Saying he's completely useless. 38 yards now. I don't know what the hell his goalkeeper was doing there. Definitely making me and Alan Shearer look a hell of a lot better than we actually are. But Division 1, a goal like that? Yes, please. Okay. So there's a hell of a lot less stress on us now. So much less, in fact. Ibra's already hit the post as well. Um, so I could very well be 2 nothing up. Although, to be fair, this guy's had a few pretty close calls. Um, that is a dumb pass right there. What the hell was up with the delay with that, dude? <laughs> huh? Please! That was a good pass, too! He just ran right past the ball! Come on, come on, Doombia, piss off. Piss off. Piss off. Piss off! No, just don't dive in. There will be a penalty given if, the, if I do... Oh, shit. Wow, what the fuck? What is fucking happening?! Oh! Somehow still one nothing. Sweet mother. Alright. Now he is in acres of space. I guarantee you when the ball gets there, he'll be perfectly marked. Oh, no, they're not. Nah, you fucking virgin idiot. Oh! Did I get that? I don't know why I cut in there. Honestly, I like it's just stupid. It's a good play though. It's a good play. That's a dumb play. You're a bitch. You're a moron, Nick! Come on. Just no goals. No goals at halftime. Simple passes. That's a terrible pass. And he's read that one. Holy fudging. Okay. It's actually pretty good. Ibra's got space. God, I love you, Ibra. Ibra doesn't have space anymore. Pjanic caught up to him. Um, okay, what are we at? Three minutes of added time? I should have made... I should at least have made it to halftime with the lead. Okay, this is probably going to be the last play. There we go. All right. 
one nothing thanks to a wonder free kick from Alan Shearer. Didn't realize that he had that good of free kicks, honestly. Um, let's have a look at the stats. So there you go. It's been a pretty tight game as it feels like most division games are. You know what? Division 1 games, at least. You don't just run away with, uh, with games. Every once in a while you get stomped, like me, you know, and every once in a while maybe you'll run away with one game, but I would say the high percentage is just really tight, squeaky bum games. Yes, please. Fuck, man, these passes, those passes should be better. Shearer, you bitch! What the fuck? That's the shit I'm talking about, man! That was put on a platter for him! Just literally put your left peg down and just direct it into the net! Who the sweet fuck was asking you to take a touch there? I was tapping shoot! And I didn't put a lot of power on it that would make him, like, take a touch to settle himself? What the f- Oh my god, dude. Okay, don't get tilted, Nick. This is where you need to remain calm. Oh man, come on, come on! What was the when the weather that shit happened? The fiftieth minute, something like that. Fifty fifth minute. I think this guy's actually still on defensive as well, which is impressive. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Now I can't go full tilt even if I concede because it doesn't matter. Just need a point. I need to remember that. I am such a rage, rage machine. Then I'll forget that and start breaking shit if I concede a goal here. Just gotta try and keep my cool. <clears throat> Talk myself into being calm. There you go, Leno. Leno's got us. Leno, Leno is good enough where even if I screw up once or twice, he'll he'll make the save. Just gotta gotta cover the rebounds if anything. There we go. That's a good turn. That's a good turn. Do I try that again? Okay. Second time's a charm, I suppose. That's a terrible pass. Oh my. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Yes. Okay. 20-something minutes left. Okay, that's crazy. Didn't want that to go there, but it, we'll take it. Lovely. What a ball! Oh my god, what? It bounced past the keeper and over. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> okay. All right, come on, stay calm. Stay calm, dude. Unbelievable. Come on, boys. Cheer. Okay. Cheer just can't get a regular goal. He has to score like a wonder goal in Oh God. And everything else is crap. What are you doing? 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 You're not doing no. Not doing anything. That's an AIDS pass, but I'll take it. He missed it, didn't he? Oh my God, dude. What the fuck? Why would that guy call the keeper out at one nothing? I'm not gonna lie though, it genuinely worked. That confused the shit out of me. For a second I was like, am I in the foot draft? Am I beating this guy 17 nothing? The fuck is he calling someone out? Come on. Oh my god, that's a play. That's a pen! That's something, surely! Oh my- And you guys wonder why I lose my shit. You guys wonder why I lose my shit. How is that not a, I mean, maybe it wasn't a pen, but it's gotta be a free kick or something. What the fuck is going on, dude? Okay. It's a sick ball too. Oh my God, dude. This has been an action packed second half though. I don't think I'm even gonna edit much of this out, honestly been a ridiculous second half I freaking played so well too which is slightly frustrating here we go here we go come on oh my god Alan Shearer I can't I don't know what I need to do there Braden thank you so much dude appreciate the resubscription I have no voice my voice is genuinely gone Oh, God. Come on. I do feel like I've played some really good footy here, so if, if I drop... Even if I drop points, I would be a little salty. This guy's going for sweat, too. Unreal. Four more minutes. Five more minutes. Come on, boys. Come on. We got this. Um, okay, let's pump this up the field here. 
Right there. Okay, perfect. And Tep, you just go on a run. He doesn't have any gas left, so... I don't know, I think that was the only option. Miranda, okay, so this guy's on ultra attacking. That's his center back, yeah? So let's just blast it up the field then. There we go. That's fine. I'm fine for that bit of wasted time. Oh, wow. Okay, how did you get away with that? If I did that, honestly, my opponent's striker would have picked up the ball. There we go, lovely. Ibra, he's onside. He's onside. He's not onside. Oh, he's not onside. Damn, Ibra's had two incredible games. I really like those kits as well, by the way. They look really, really nice. You going back up the middle? No. Okay. Fudge. Fudge. Two minutes of added time. Give me the win. I want the win now. I don't just want the shitty draw. I don't want just the shitty draw, which I feel like is going to happen here. Come on. Come on. Defend. Oh, God. Oh, God. Have mercy. Oh, the cheese. Just get rid of it. Get rid of it! What the... Oh, my God. Why he didn't clear it there? I have no idea. But there it is. That is the end of the game. We got a win that we didn't need. We managed to hold on one nothing. If only that first game was a bit different. If only it was a bit different, we would legitimately be pushing for a Division One title right now. So a bit of heartbreak, I do have to say. Shearer, though, like, missed. What? Scored that free kick. That free kick was probably one of the better free kicks I've scored in a long time. But, like, missed chance after chance after chance. Now, who got man of the match here? That's going to be interesting. Is it Leno? It's Benatia. I mean, the entire team did well, really. So that time got a 6.4. So I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. This is where we finish it off. Uh, there are the final stats of the game. Uh, I'm not too worried if you guys see gamer tags, etc., etc. I did want to show you guys this. So there you go. We got 7,500 coins for the, 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 I guess, holding Division 1. We also got about 1,500 more coins for uh, the game plus the 1,000 coin bonus. So just playing Divisions right now, um, and even just playing... Um, uh tournaments and stuff we are making so many coins so i want to know from you guys first of all smash the like button on the video if you did enjoy the video i want to know from you guys who you want me to replace up here i'm gonna bring in another legend striker i think for next episode we start uh, uh, we'll see i'm thinking we start our next division run with this team or at the very least with ibra and at cam and do something around that because I'm I've genuinely really really enjoyed using Ibra. To be fair, this team was great at Cam. You know, a goal and an assist in three games isn't bad at all. Um, you know, Shearer I bitched and moaned about, and honestly, he should have had about seven goals in those three games. You know, the assists I don't care about, but as a finisher with 90 shooting, I don't know why I struggle with him so hard. Um, I really enjoyed using Intep, even though he got one assist. Willian I loved using as well, and he did nothing in terms of goal scores, uh, goal scoring and assisting. Ramirez and Matuidi were a beautiful partnership as well. I really enjoyed this setup here. Those three were fantastic. And then the back line, to be fair, were lovely too. So maybe there's a few changes in there, but otherwise not too, too much. So if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching the video. Thank you so much for supporting the series, both on Twitch and on YouTube. I hope you guys enjoy it. And until next time, we'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.